A BBC introducing reporter Liz Farwell also talks to a metal band, or doom metal band, and a crisis. Such great lads, really young, really talented. But now we're going to change the vibe. We, uh, we're going to go over to BBC introducing metal reporter. Let's call a metal reporter Liz Farwell on all things heavy and noisy. Turn up your radio or turn it down. Liz starts this interview with a band called Anna Crisis uh, like this. She finds out who they are. I'm James, known as Moody, uh, as the drummer of the band and backing vocalist. Uh, I'm also James. People call me Reynolds because there's two Jameses. Of course. Um, I play bass in the band. Yeah, uh, I'm Ben. (laughs) Uh, our other guitarist is called Ben as well, so they normally call me Bessie, and I'm actually lead guitarist. Can you only be in the band if you have the name of someone else that's already in the band? That's the rule. Is that the rule? Because it seems to, be, yeah. <laughs> seems to be you all have the same name. So I know you guys are relatively new. You've only been together for about a year. How did you guys meet? How did you like come together? Well, we all... We all uh, so we, well, we've all been mates, most of us. There's the three of us, which is Reynolds... Uh, ben Swingler, which is our rhythmic guitarist, uh, and me, we, we've met in school and we've been playing ever since then. And then Bessie, we met him at uh, college. college. Yep. And uh, yeah, that was sort of just yeah. came together. Yeah. yeah. So were you always in Anna Crisis or were you in different bands? Or We just played different bands around, around Ke- like, we played gigs around Ketchering in other bands, but they didn't really work out because yeah. otherwise yeah, apart either, from me of course yeah as well, as well. So me, me Reynolds and Swing though yeah uh, if I remember rightly I remember playing a gig with one band and Moody coming up to me afterwards like saying we really want you in this band man like what you're doing up there was sick. And but didn't you leave the hairs and join the other? <laughs> yeah, I left like straight away. I was like, yeah, cool, man. <laughs> nice, so it worked out pretty well. Yeah. yeah. So you mentioned some gigs that you've been doing. I know you're playing at the Racehorse on the 14th of December. Yeah. Have you got much more lined up before and after then, or is that kind uh, of the um, main one before Christmas? We've got a couple coming up in uh, January, actually. Um, we've got two. It's a, is it a Saturday and a Sunday at yeah, the Zombie Yeah, 23rd Hut? and 24th, I think. And uh, we've got some more in February, I think, with a few other bands um, but so, so far for the year it's just the racehorse to finish up on I oh think. brilliant nice place to finish for the yeah. year yeah. Yeah. So working on getting all the new material ready for the new year so. yes because you've been in the studio recently haven't you so what yeah. what are you guys working on at the minute an album or just a single or we're releasing an EP yeah we? it was more of an EP yeah, yeah. what's it going to be called can you tell us Teasers. Um, we've, we've had, had a few loads names. of different names, haven't we? Um, yeah. I think the one that we were going to go for was Immortals, but then that sort of changed. Because it was as... all about Greek mythology, because obviously the name Anachrysis comes from a Greek term. Of course. So we were doing Uriel, Medusa's older sister, and all the, obviously Medusa, etc., etc. That's, that's so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that is really cool. That's really cool. So we're coming up to Christmas, and I know I kind of said this to you off air, but I would love to know what Christmas song you would like to hear any metal band cover? I don't know any Christmas songs, so I'm out of Come this. on. <laughs> any Christmas song. Any Christmas uh, song. You could have Cliff Richard. You could have the Pogues. Uh, I'd like to hear Steel Panther have a little go at a Christmas song. I don't know which one, because like I said, I don't know any. Any Christmas song by Steel Panther would probably be hilarious. <laughs> yes. Anyone else got any good ideas for Christmas songs? Oh, uh, I don't know. I think, seriously, I'd love to see Avenge do a, a Christmas track, but I don't know. I think some... I'd love to see uh, a band f- also formed a catcher in uh, What Lies Have In. I'd love to see them do one. I think they'll... I think they'll do they'll... So if anybody listening wants to hear a bit more about you, find out where you're gigging, anything like that, where can they find you? Well, I created a web uh, website a few months back now, will not it? And yeah, it's yeah. on there. It's got. Uh, you can go on our Facebook page. It's uh, on that's there, probably the easiest place to go. And the website is on our. I think is it about? On, if you click on about on it, it's down. Scroll yeah. down to the bottom. Our website's on there, and you click on our tours and gigs, and it. it yeah, you know, it will come up on there. Videos most on the YouTube information yeah. is on the Facebook page. Everything is yeah. on the fa- everything you need to know is on the either the Facebook page or the website. That's sort of the main Anna Crisis hub for like information. I like it. Yeah. The Anna Crisis hub. That's what you should call it. <laughs> well, awesome. Thank you very much for speaking to me. It's all right. And have a merry Christmas. You, you too. too. <laughs> <laughs>